why Kate and William do this more when traveling abroad, but not when in the UK. Kate Middleton and Prince William's next overseas tour is yet to be announced, as Meghan and Harry begin their tour of Australasia. Kate and William, however, often do something abroad they rarely do in the UK. Kate Middleton, 36, and Prince William, 36, have undertaken a number of overseas tours in the name of the Crown. Canada, Australia and India are just some of the destinations they have traveled to as a couple. However, the pair are notoriously private and are not as affectionate in public compared to Meghan Markle and Prince Harry. They do show more affection abroad compared to the UK. However, their public displays of affections have increased over the years as the royal protocol relaxes. The royal family originally would dissuade royal couples from being romantic in the public eye due them performing work duties. Yet the pair, along with Meghan and Harry, have shown care towards each other on a number of occasions during their tours. The pair were spotted hugging while on a mountain hike in Bhutan, a rare display of affection between the two. In India, Kate and William were caught gazing at each other during a visit to Kaziranga National Park. William is also spotted putting his hand on her back while they meet foreign representatives. The pair may feel they can perform more naturally with other when abroad, due to the romantic settings of their destinations. Yet they showed a rare display recently in Windsor during Princess Eugenie's wedding when they were spotted holding hands during the service. Body language expert Judy James told Express. Kate reached across to place a hand on the arm of her husband's chair and he put his own hand over it in a very romantic gesture. Their smiles together have changed and their affection and love signals are much more intense and open than ever before suggesting the birth of their third child has somehow thrown them back into the honeymoon stage of their relationship. Meghan and Harry, however, are much more tactile both in the UK and abroad. They are often holding hands or leaning close to each other. The pair who recently announced they are expecting their first child, will most likely be even more hands-on during their tour of Australasia. Meghan was spotted leaning her head on his shoulder after one press event, with Harry often caught holding on to her. Even Queen Elizabeth and Prince Philip have been caught on occasion being affectionate in public. There have been a number of occasions where he Philip kissed his wife on the cheek.